Today I'm going to be paying respect to a man I call my father, the father of the current president of the DRC, a father to all of Africa, a true Pan-Africanist, Pa Etienne Chisakedi, by visiting his museum outskirts of Kinshasa. This is something I promised to do and I'm going to carry it out. So come with me and let us pay respect to us. Wow, this this is, is, thank you. This is the, this is the Kedi Museum. It's where the father of the president is laid to rest. And I would like to see if I can see. If I can go in there to see. Of course, it's heavily guarded. Uh, I don't know if they have times of visit. So cool. It's a historic place here. Ah, it's here. It's a Kedis. Right, so we gained access and we are permitted to go in and take mausoleum. Uh, we had to pull some strings to get that happen. But that's why we're soldiers. <laughs> so this is a very historic place people. This man is one of the real heroes of Africa. Man who believed in principles, believed in Africa. He was a true Pan-Africanist. He fought for his people. He was a selfless politician who wanted the good for his people. He fought the hard fight, and this is his resting place. You know, these chills around you when you're with, when you're around people like this. Even though he's gone, his spirit is is everywhere here. I mean. I don't want to be labeled a politician, I'm not, but an Africanist. This okay. is the that's, that's the case to bring it, the body from uh, Europe. Okay. Yeah, that's why they still keep it here. Hmm. Yeah. These are great men, great men of Africa, and this is where he's laid. I mean, I was in the U.S. watching the ceremonies, and now I'm in his presence. This is totally, totally a, a surreal experience. And uh, what can I say? What can I say? All I can say is a prayer for the repose of his soul and the pride that we as Africans have for him. That's okay, let me just give me yeah.
Je These are the people we need in Africa. Caliber of people we need in Africa. Thank you. Huge compound. I'm told that they're going to construct some buildings over there for the for the guards who protect this place and look after the mausoleum. It's a, it's a most beautiful place, I tell you. You have the highway just right in front. It's absolutely beautiful. This is why I love Africa, man. It's January. It's about maybe 85, 90 degrees outside. And this is cool. This is so cool. And I tell all my diasporans, if you ever have a chance, ah, make some chance. Come back here. Man. Come to Africa. It doesn't have to be. The message is not just for Congolese. If you're a Nigerian man, visit Congo. If you're a Congolese man, visit Nigeria. Africa is yours. Do not follow some thieves who divided your land at the convention they call, uh, what the hell did they call that convention in 1884? Some raggedy place in Germany. They decided to give you identities that are not yours. Just to split you. You must repair. You must repair that. You can't follow their rules. If you follow their rules, we'll be divided forever. And we may conquer forever. We need that spirit of Africa take over. Let us be one Africa. It's the only way we can be to grow. Thank you all. Guys, take a good look at developments around this place. You know, when I came here three years ago, there was nothing. Nothing. It was just a, a bush. The highway going through. I remember all these places, all these are new. New, new, new houses. New development, see them as far as your eye can see. You know, land in this area now is, uh, I'm told, it's very pricey. Rightfully so. You're only like maybe 10 minutes away from the international airport, if that far. And uh, this is where the city is going. No doubt in my mind. City is going to expand to this place. So, real estate in this place is going to, it's going to be huh, what is best in it. So, my advice is if you're a diaspora, find your way here and get your piece of land. You will thank me later. Yes, that concluded our visit to the museum. That was a fantastic experience. And I just wanted to drive around the area, around the museum, just to show you 
the development that's coming up in this place. If you look to your left, you start to see housing uh, uh, estates coming up. People are building new houses in these places. You can see how beautiful the land truly is. I mean, I, I find these places to be so beautiful. I mean, look to your right, you see that river there. I mean, that is something that will beautify a place later if properly handled. And the terrain is out of this world. For those of you in diaspora, this is a place where you can build a house that has some land. Do you have space? to breathe instead of being smack in the middle of the city or trying to put your head in here this place is very close to this the, even the city is close it's just the traffic right now and there are there are roads are uh, in planning i'm told that will decongest that traffic you can't wait for that to happen before you act you have to proact i am reliably informed that Though land in this area is expensive, you can still get a good-sized plot of land for about 10K. That is a steal. I, I don't even believe it, but that was what I was told by somebody who should know. Um, um, don't quote me, but that's a reference. That's a reference. I mean, information is powerful, people. These are places we could turn into places that we can be very proud of in terms of living and and doing business, setting up businesses and all of that. So I just want to drive around, pan around the area and show it to you. Just enjoy the watch. I want to thank you all for watching these videos. We've come to the end of this episode. I really, really I hope that you guys are enjoying these videos as much as I do reckoning them. I'm really just trying to show you opportunities in your land and things of interest in your land. I thank you so much for staying with me. Please, I still need your subscriptions. Uh, God bless you all. Thank you. One more quick thing. I'd like to please, please, please ask you to please watch through the ads that come with this video and that as that is the only way i can get any credit for them please be patient watch through the ads thank you god bless you